some of the most cutting-edge education-focused technologies have been showcased at Edutech Africa 2018. Where schools and teachers are able to take some of these solutions and implement them in the classroom to help the advancement of teaching, children's development, as well as finding a way to genuinely combine new advanced technology with traditional teaching methods um, to help the children adjust and really find a way to improve their level of learning and performance and results. South Africa's education system faces major challenges. Schools are often short of resources and student dropout levels are high. Edutech hopes to combat this by showing the opportunities technology can offer in the classroom. So there's a lot of content on offer which ranges from how to use the technology in the classroom to also um, upskilling the teacher, um, in turn upskilling the principals in how to manage the implementation of technology into their schools, managing the budget through this kind of process, um, improving uh, teacher uptake. Developers are also coming up with inventions that make learning more exciting. One example is teachers leveraging Minecraft, one of the world's most popular games, for use in the classroom. Students are almost geared up and, and wired nowadays to think along these lines. The fact that our tools can help them to do that and meet them there rather than doing it the way we've been doing it 20 years ago makes total sense that they actually want to use it at home now, meaning they're actually learning while having fun. I think what this offers is more than just math. It's physics, it's science, it's a lot to do with incorporating what they're learning in the classroom environment um, and using Minecraft and their subject combined. I think children learn much more and they won't realize they're learning because they're learning through play and I think that's very important in today's time. It's really interesting because Minecraft is my favorite game and having it in the classroom is just amazing. So normal Minecraft doesn't have all the physics and stuff but the Minecraft Education Edition does and I think it's really interesting because you get to experiment with things that just weren't there before by bringing the most innovative minds together from across education and technology, Edutech Africa ignites new ideas and inspires audiences to think differently. You've got uh, mechanical solutions, you've got digital solutions all being merged into one and um, mechanization is coming whether we like it or not and for the future of kids in this country and other countries, for them to survive and, and let's say be marketable in a future world and this is what these products are doing. They're teaching kids to be comfortable with mechanizing things, programming things, fun, playful way. So they're growing up with it being naturally part of what they do. To ensure young South Africans can compete globally, the government is determined to improve the education system. And these products and technologies may be the future of schooling in the country. Julie Shara, CGTN, Johannesburg, South Africa.